Feeling bored. Overcoming boredom can be difficult. But there are many ways you can make a dull situation more entertaining. Find ways to channel your creativity by reading, writing, or making crafts. Take advantage of dull moments by being productive. Work on a task you've been putting off or learn a new skill. Get together with your friends when you're bored and find exciting things to do around town. Find ways to have fun. Just because you're bored at home doesn't mean you can't relax and laugh a little. Here are 10 ways on how not to be boring again by a clinical psychologist. And we are starting right now. Quick announcement. We are giving away these two best-selling books for free. Both are still selling in Amazon. Grab it now. Link in the description. But, wait. Only for our subscribers only. For those who didn't subscribe yet, do it now. Ubermind is on our way to 2,000 subscribers. Support from you will be amazing, thank you. Number 1. Make your goals spicy. Check what you're aiming for this month, this year and in life. If your goals make you feel tired and bored then you're probably tired and bored with life. You are also tired and boring to be with. Throw out the list and make a new one full of things that light you up. Number 2. Drop the cool act. If your reason for getting up is to post airbrushed selfies and keep everything you say and do lined up with your personal brand. Go away, you're making us yawn. Don't take yourself so seriously. You are not as cool as you think, no one is. Number 3. Tell stories but know when to stop. Telling a great story will make you a people magnet. Not knowing when to stop will do the opposite. Be aware of the difference. Number 4. Hide your phone from yourself. Visible phones give others the impression you'd rather be somewhere else. Or you're waiting for someone cooler to call. We're all guilty of this but once you get over your offline angst. Being phone free will help you stay in the moment. Number 5. Initiate something. Anything. Get off the couch. When was the last time you came up with a spontaneous activity for you and your partner, family, friends? Then followed through on it. Surprise them and they'll look at you with fresh eyes. Number 6. Take the muzzle off. Voice your opinions, try hard to lock your inner critic in a cage. Even if you struggle with shyness or social anxiety, take a tiny risk. You can't get through life saying all the right things. And having everyone love you not even close, so get in the game now. Number 7. Screw with your routines. Don't be and do same old, same old, every day. Change it up. Enough said. Number 8. Do, or try, interesting things. It will give you interesting things to talk about. It will give people something to ask you about. Mostly, it will give you more investment in your own life. And that excitement will radiate through you. Number 9. Take a conversation somewhere. Be curious. When talking to someone, wait for their response and take it somewhere that relates to them. Then do it again. All roads shouldn't lead back to yourself. Number 10 smile. Being told to smile is patronizing. But when you see someone laughing and smiling in the world, it's human nature to want a piece of that. Also smiling is very, very easy. Why not do the simple stuff first? Thanks for watching. See you in the next video. So, was this video helpful? 
Let us know in the comments below. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up, and share with your friends, so we can keep making them. For more videos like this, hit the subscribe button and click the notification bell. Also, be sure to check our other videos as well. Thanks for watching.